If you've ever used a spreadsheet as input for a phantom, you'll know that the phantom looks in column A to find your input data. Now, what happens if your input data is not found in column A? Just like in my input spreadsheet right here, I want the phantom to process my profile URLs, which are in column C. So how do I tell it this? Well, I need to look for a field in my phantom setup called column name from which to get profile URLs. In this phantom, LinkedIn Network Booster, this field is under advanced settings, but this is not always the case. So what is column name? Well, if I go back to my spreadsheet, your column name is the header of your column as found in row one. It is not the column letter. So mine in this instance is profile URL, which I'm going to copy and paste directly into my phantoms configuration and save. And this means that the next time that the phantom launches, it will find my profile URLs in this column. Now, a particularly useful instance of this and when you might need it is, for example, if I want to auto follow Instagram profiles whose posts I've extracted from a specific hashtag. So I've used Instagram hashtag collector. Here's my output. But as you can see, the post URL is in column A when I need to give the auto follow phantom the profile URL, which is column B. So all I have to do when setting up my Instagram auto follow phantom using this output spreadsheet is tell it to find the profile URLs in profile URL column. Now this field is case sensitive, so you do need to make sure that the title that you enter into your phantom setup is exactly what you can see in your spreadsheet.